the path to fulfilling life's needs. Shui Feng, American psychologist Maslow, identified six fundamental human needs, physiological, safety, love and belonging, esteem, self-actualization, and self-transcendence. In detail, these include the need for food, water, air, sex, sleep, personal safety, access to resources, healthcare, job security, family, friendship, love, respect from others, social status, confidence, a sense of achievement, ethics, competence, and creativity. Maslow also proposed that human needs are hierarchical, meaning lower level needs must be satisfied before higher level needs can be addressed. In other words, only after physiological needs are met can one pursue safety needs, and only after self-actualization can one strive for self-transcendence. Uh, my own theory on life's needs is a house with a bed, a desk and a chair, three sets of clothes, two pairs of shoes, two basic meals a day, surrounded by like-minded individuals in harmony with my consciousness, daily tasks to engage in, a clean, orderly, and beautiful environment, shared resources with everyone without coercion, voluntary participation, peace, harmony, warmth, health, ideals, dreams, understanding of life and the cosmos, and a clear path to the realms life can reach. So, how can we achieve this ideal? Maslow progresses from lower to higher needs, where I suggest moving from higher to lower needs. In exploring the principles of Tao, the way, virtue, benevolence, righteousness, propriety, wisdom, fidelity, accomplishment, law, and skill, I find that possessing the Tao grants everything else. Starting from the lower level to pursue skills, one can never reach the realm of the Tao, as life is too short. By the time lower level needs are fully satisfied, there's no time or energy left to pursue the Tao. Therefore, the primary pursuit in life should be a clear understanding of the path ahead and the realms that life can achieve. Once this critical issue is resolved, everything else falls into place. I was once obsessed with making money, running my own company, shops, a nightclub, a bar, a fast food restaurant, and renting out a dance hall, a restaurant, and a barber shop, earning hundreds of thousands annually. However, a car accident was a wake-up call, reminding me of life's fragility and the importance of understanding life's value, purpose, principles, and mysteries. Without this understanding, life is aimless, and fulfilling its various needs is impossible. So I gave up my business to delve into the meaning of life and existence, concluding that prioritizing the highest level of needs allows other needs to be naturally met as the highest level is gradually achieved. Today, I fulfilled all of life's needs and achieved an ideal that even presidents and billionaires struggle to realize. What do I need now? Nothing, except to enjoy life and engage in whatever I find enjoyable. Concerns about food, clothing, shelter, transportation, aging, illness, death, fame, fortune, and leaving a legacy no longer apply to me. Everyone who has ever engaged with my ideas has benefited, making me a suitable and rightful guide in life and existence. October 23rd, 2014.